<laughs> All right, what's up, man? Hey, guess what? Huh. Ryan has wanted to have Domino's since he watched a Trish mukbang video where she was eating it. Yeah. And we haven't had Domino's in about two years. Yeah, so. we, we've oh, had shit. it. It's been good before. This um, is a Meat Man pizza. No, we got a Meat Man pizza. Oh, it's so powdery on the bottom. Oh. Oh. So. I'm going to eat a piece of it. Oh, it's hand. foldy. It's very foldable. So what this is, is it's a pepperoni, bacon, ham pizza. Eight bucks, was yep. it? Eight bucks for a large Eight bucks for toppings. a large three topping pizza. What's it taste like? Is it too hot? Yeah. Oh, I'm burning my face off. The ham is good in the bacon. No, it's really good. It's a good computer. A good computer for Papa John's. What's the sauce taste like? Sauce is okay. It's, it's kind of salty, actually. Maybe it's all those meats. Let me try a bite. Mm -hmm. I hate pepperoni, but... It's very um foldable. It's like kind of like a... It's soft. So to me already, I don't like that type of pizza. Yeah, we're, yeah I think we're both more into crispiers. The ham, though, man, it's the size of a pepperoni. It's huge. Mm. What do you think? It's good. Yeah. It's good. I just hate that it's not crispy crust. I don't like flat pizza. Like, uh, Was that an option pizzas. on there? Not really. Because I know, like... Well, it's not like... Because the thing is, I like pan pizzas, like Pizza Hut, and the ones that they do at Papa John's, because I love the crispiness. Yeah, they do it really crispy, but they also but give you the option to crisp it there, The too. cheese is great on this. The meat is great. It's good. It's not bad. It's just, I wish it was crispy. Yeah. Very greasy. It's very greasy. Very good. Um... The thing is, at the end of the day... A great price for a pizza with that many meats on it. Mm. Now, compare it to Papa John's. Yeah. Papa John's got that sauce. The thing is, yeah, Papa John's got the sauce and they got the crisp. Mm-hmm. This is good cheese. Our both say, well... This has good meat. It has better meat. Mm-hmm. I'd say better cheese. Yeah, yeah. the cheese is really melt. That type of holy cheese. I would cheese. say the only difference between this and Papa John's is the crisp. And the sauce. And the sauce, And yeah. I'm a sauce person. I love a sweet sauce. My pizza's got to have a sweet sauce. Yeah, I would say that this is pretty damn good, though. Yeah, totally worth the eight bucks. I wouldn't say this is better than Papa John's. It's, I, a, con it's a... I would say that they're pretty much equal. on the same tier. Yep. The only pizza... My favorite pizza right now is Carosa pizza. Yeah. I, I like pizza. I was going to say the same thing. The pizza, the... This is what a pizza tastes like to me. It is paper thin. It's so greasy. And it has this taste of a mall pizza. Yeah. It has to come from the mall. That's... It. When I think of pizza, that's the first thing that comes to my head is this... And there's some kind of spice that's in the sauce. And it's paper thin and it's so crispy, you crunch into it. I don't... It's perfect. So this... So Carosa's perfect to me. This is the tier list in my opinion. If we're talking to straight taste, yeah, Carosa and Sicilian Delight, they're at the top. top. And, I mean, it fulfills all of it for me, yeah. so those are my favorite pizzas. Yeah, those are definitely, I think, on the same level. Um, and then medium tier would be these guys, this and Domino, Papa John's. Pizza Hut is really... Pizza Hut's, I guess, in the medium tier. Kinda. Yeah, no, because when you get a good Pizza Hut pizza that takes you back to when you went inside the Pizza Hut, then it's good. But it's rare to get it because this is like... What were you drinking in this, this pizza? This is the thing. Tell me about this pizza. Out of a red cup. A red cup, okay. And it was so, some type of soda. Or high C if they had it back then. I think they did at Pizza Hut too. This I one. felt like I always got Pepsi's and I, lo you I always still love Pepsi. Pepsi. The yeah. thing is, Pizza Hut is the only pizza that still puts hey, a little... It looks like iDubs. Look at that man. <gasps> he looks like iDubs. Is it him? Pizza Hut is the only pizza place that still puts a little table in the pizza. Okay? Yeah. In the middle so the box doesn't touch it. When they make their cheese, it has brown dots on it. It does. And when it's pan and they do it perfectly, like you're not late picking up, it's fresh. That pizza's unrivaled. That is a, that's like eating nostalgia. It's literally eating your definition of like the best night of your life. Your parents take you to fucking Pizza Hut. The red lights are on. You're drinking out of the red cups. It's it. The smell, everything. Yeah. So to me, that would be the second greatest pizza under, under the... Carosa in Sicilian to me is the equivalent of Luigi's because there was this place when I was growing up called Luigi's in the mall and it was the best pizza I ever had. And they're the only now, well, places. How would you they describe are the their only pizza, though? places that still taste like that. How would you describe their pizza? 
That's what I'm saying. It's thin. It's thin. It's thin. It's crispy. It's crispy. Not crispy like you're biting into a taco. Yeah, I don't like think it, my ears yeah. think that's what it yeah, is. Cr it's, cr it's, it's the bottom of the crust. It's solid. It's a big solid It don't bend slice. at all. It's firm and it's crispy. I knew that was going to fucking flip directly over. Okay, and okay. it's fucking... It has a spice in it. Yeah. There's some type of spice that they use in the sauce. And it's in the Careful. Listen, they're going on a ride with us. The viewers. Nick's. When I say the viewers, I mean Nick. Me meaning one person. I mean specifically Nick and maybe us in the future. Yeah, that's show Spencer. The show Spencer. Like when we had that. Uh, hello. This is directed. Hello. This video is directed at Domino's and Ithaca. No, hello. This video is directed to McDonald's and Trip Hammer. I don't know. Uh, that's an iconic. Listen, that's Sorry. an iconic video. But uh, you have no idea what we just went through before we got this pizza. I just got done cleaning an apartment for one of my sorority girls, and I apparently she had pneumonia, and I wasn't told, so I'm probably gonna get pneumonia. Yeah. But uh, apparently, I accidentally threw away her pneumonia medication because it was, you know, it was up where I was dusting and doing Lysol, so I yeah. think it got mixed in with my paper towels, whatever. So she, my phone right now, I don't have service, so I can only get texts when I'm on Wi-Fi. So when I got home after cleaning, she's like, "The pills are missing. It's a fucking emergency." I was like, "Oh my god." What? Like, are you going to get sick? She's like, I have pneumonia. I said, I'm driving back now and I'm going in the dumpster. I said, because that's the only place it could be. Yeah, exactly. And so and Ryan threw me into the dumpster and I found the pills and I gave them back to her and she was uh, very happy. Were, okay, good. She was very okay. happy. Okay. And we decided, hey, we did a really good deed for somebody so they can cure their pneumonia and then we should get the pizza. Yeah. Even though I can't eat bad food right now, but at least I took a bite. It's okay. Eat a couple of meats. Yeah. Those are good. The meat's meat. fine. I'm trying to get Ryan to do a keto slash paleo diet for like at least a week to see if he wants to do it if he can be like serious about it. I think it. I can do it. It's the best and quickest way to lose Tell me the foods I can eat. Any meat, literally. A meat, name a meat, you can have it. What about steak? Yes. What about pulled pork? Yes. Not, But not cut smear with barbecue sauce. But pulled pork you can't, has to be. Well, then you can't have that. Fuck. You can't have anything that has sugar. That has. This is my house. It's already yeah. house. Shahar? You can't have anything that has a lot of sugar in it. At all. Well, you're not supposed to have any sugar at all, but I guess like I can make an example, like a yeah. A tiny... There's no way. I, yeah, barbecue sauce, I can eat a little. But bit. it can't be like a, no. I'm not gonna eat like, like a half of a container. Yeah, like a whole bottle. Yeah. Yeah, that's absurd. You can have any vegetable. What about French fries? No. What about um? You you can have you yes you, but no bread. With no bread. Yep. What if it's in like a pita wrap that no. has no calories? But they do. That flipped over again. I can't reach you, dude. I'm driving. And I can't reach because I'm too okay, short. Okay, I can reach you. I'm fine. God, we're going to get in an accident for the stupid shit we do. Listen, we're, it's not stupid. You can't have any bread at all. What about um, an extra meat? Yeah. What if I put a burger inside of two of those big mushrooms that you yes, like? Yes. Yeah. Exactly. You could eat that. That'd be perfect. What if I use those mushrooms as bread? Yes. No, that'd be the most succulent, rich thing you've ever eaten in your life. It probably changed your life how good it is. Really? Two sauteed portobello mushrooms with a cheeseburger in the middle. Now, are you fucking what kidding What kind me? of nutrients are in a mushroom? A big portobello? I think they have a lot of iron because they come out of the dirt. It's a lot of iron. Like, no, zero calories. We're going, we're going, we're going. And there goes that again. Listen, this video will also not be edited, so enjoy. Enjoy looking at the top enjoy of that this. plastic. You bastards. Yeah, uh, like name something that you want to eat. I don't know. I see this little 